Jerome Hatch in the red gloves, Eric Wallin in the blue for the Fierce FC Light Heavyweight Championship. This main event is brought to you by Water and Wellness. Change your water, change your life. No blood touch from Hatch. 29 years of MMA experience come between these two. Seasoned veterans with a belt on the line to add to their decorated resumes. Full of steam early as Eric Wallin able to separate. Back to the center of the cage are the two fighters. Wallin, a boxing champion. Hatch, a bare knuckle champion. Your Hatch is son saying to put your hands up. It's got to be such a weird experience watching your dad fight. Never imagined that. A nice knee to the body, but Jerome returns one as well in the process. Right up against the broadcast booth, Waleen with a couple of knees there. We are in the blood zone again. And the spin zone, I think. And the spin zone. <laughs> Two Utah native fighters here tonight. No home crowd for either one. Into the front headlock position is Waleen. Nice little snap down from Doing a good job wrestling here, Caitlin. Able to separate. Our Hatch and Wallin. Wallin coming out with a fast pace tonight. 60% of all wins coming by KO for Wallin. 56% for Jerome Hatch. Obviously, this fight already gone longer than their first matchup back in 2014. to see Jerome set those punches up a little bit more. Wallin sees those coming. Both kind of searching for that shot, it seems like, Caitlin. Yeah, I mean, that's more of a typical heavyweight fight is where the pace is a little bit slower and they're looking for that one big shot. Oh, and there was a long Jerome just shot. landed it. And he's hurt. Her, her, Waleen is hurt. He's wobbled. He's doing desperate takedowns. Waleen searching in on that foot. But, I mean, hey, he got the takedown. We'll see if Jerome can get it right back up. Hatch back against the cage, trying to get back up. There he goes. Waleen trying to grapple a bit. Hatch punching his way out of it as much as he can. Snap down from Hatch head full of steam here. Waleen up against the cage, searching for the takedown once again. Back and forth we go. Waleen back to the grappling. Hatch going to try to get back up. I mean, Waleen is really good at getting this front headlock and snapping him down. Waleen with a twister as well as a calf slicer finish. 13-time expert division jiu-jitsu champion on top of his tenured MMA and boxing careers. Definitely has the grappling underneath him. Three submission wins out of his 10 of his career. There's one Achilles heel for Jerome Hatch. It's, it's on the ground. And, we'll and he's... Get that calf slicer. That's what he's trying to set up right here. Last submission win for Eric Wallin, April 29th, 2016. Hatch been submitted seven times, 39%. Six of those by rear naked choke as Wallin takes the back here. Final 30 seconds of round number one, Waleen 
Riding the back, but no hooks in, but still controlling, Caitlin. Yeah. As you can see, Hatch is kind of scrambling out of this position since he didn't have those hooks in. Nice, nice knee to the body. To body. Yeah. Now he's landing some big shots on Hatch's way up. Hatch That's going to town, gets back up. Looking for a finishing blow. Final seconds of round number one. Will we go to a second? And we will. Ah. What a first round for both fighters. Highs, lows. Definitely back and forth. Both fighters had great moments. These guys are not young either. These guys are both over 35 years old. Hatch, 36 years old. Waleen, 40 years old. The unofficial scorecard up on the screen. Jason, break it down for I, us. I, I thought Lan uh, Hatch landed the harder shots. I know Waleen had a couple takedowns in there. Hatch was able to get right back up. Um, I felt like uh, Hatch had him hurt a couple times. I'm going to a slight edge to Hatch in that, but it was a great back and forth first round. Waleen looks pretty tired there, Kaylin. Yeah, I mean, they're big boys. Both of them are probably pretty tired at this point. They were throwing a lot. They were getting a lot of shots landed on them a lot, and that can really take it out of you. And can I just add, as somebody that can speak from experience, as after you get over 40 years old, it, it starts to weigh on you a little bit. <laughs> so does Eric Wally try to take this fight back to the ground? Does Jerome go all out and try to finish this? Head full of steam in those final 10 seconds for Hash once he got back up. First time in the second round for quite some time for Jerome Hatch. Both fighters gassed after that first round. Very high paced first round. This fight is slated for five five minute rounds as it is a professional championship title bout. Nice kick there landed by Wally. Yeah, yeah. Fancy. Still got something in the tank. Seemingly so does Hatch as he's able to sprawl. Oh, that was a massive one. Hatch going to work. Wally not. Wally lands one to return as well. Hatch backs up. Hatch buckles him in. Waleen finds the body lock there. But I was trying to say, Waleen looked buckled there. Jerome landed a beautiful shot, Jason. Punches out of it again is Hatch. Waleen looks like he's out on his feet. Hatch is just throwing bombs. Boom, another big shot. Waleen trying to survive up against oh. the cage. A beautiful knee landed. Down goes Waleen. I don't know if Tyler saw that knee, but that was a brutal knee to the head. And Eric Waleen's searching for a submission. Hatch better watch that leg. Caitlin, how hard is it to get your jiu-jitsu going when you're down like this I mean, after I, a couple of tough shots? Yeah, I think he is hurt right here. You don't see him scrambling very much. I think he's a little bit stunned. Jerome, that's it! Get him a second belt! Jerome Hatch, two belts, five weeks, no problem! Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching Fierce Fighting Championship on YouTube. For more daily content, make sure to click that subscribe button as well as the bell so you don't miss any of our daily fights, podcast clips, highlights, as well as our full weekly podcast. If you want to tune into one of our live shows, go ahead and head over to FierceFightingChampionship.com.